ball momentarily after a quick adjustment. Ramsen will set him up, and its tap is in the air. We're underway, and the Clippers will be the ones to get possession to start this contest. Pointer from the right corner, no good. Terry with the rebound, but the ball knocked away. Good job by Rodriguez to poke that one out. Fields will get it down low. Roberson, he'll put it up, and the first point's on the board. Skyforce on the other end. It's a lob by three. He finds Emmanuel Terry. And the score is tied. Rodriguez on the right wing, being shadowed by Cook. Coming over for the help, Putney, but Rodriguez able to sneak that one up. 14 second span to get this one off. And they get it out with a three pointer. No, long two is good for Mark Loving. So the forward from Ohio State makes it a 7 2. Sky Force lead. On the other end, Rafael Putney continuing his hot storm about chest level instead of with his arms extended over his head. Three, he'll get into the lane, takes it to the cup, lays it up and in. Here come the Sky Force with Purvis. He'll slow down. Three, fought three. Instead, we'll send it back out. Here's Purvis, 4 3 on the catch and shoot, and it's good. He'll cross over and then leave it for Terry. Terry spins, spins back the other way. Using the footwork, Terry. Curves will send it in left baseline. Fields comes around on the curl. And he'll get the pick and roll, Rodriguez. Excuse me, that's Roberson able to flash to the basket. Guy Force get back in transition. Loving catch and shoot for three. No. And the rebound, Roberson able to fight for it and put it back in to make it 12 to 11. Force turning it over twice. Four points. They have yielded points on each turnover. There is a floater. Charles Cook the third. Between the Sky Force and the Clippers here at the Sanford Pentagon. Field stepping back, but no shot. Gives it up to Roberson. Nice spin on his turn. The Epitz put back, and then there's Putney with the block. Three gives up to Cook. Bounce past Putney. Three on the way. No. And the rebound. Three able to pull it down. Now Putney, he'll take it in closer, and he'll jam it down. He'll pop it over to Rodriguez, who keeps the handle. Ball mixed up in the lane, but it pops over to Loving. Loving will take it into the lane, and nice scoop and score for Loving. We mentioned Terry and his stint with the Phoenix Suns in a 10-day contract. Charles Cook the third. He's open for three, and it's good. Side to Fields. Back over to the left. Loving, double team, and it pops loose. Skyforce three on two. Here comes Purvis. He will lay it up and in. Take the defense down, and it's 21-13. Skyforce, largest lead of the game for either team at eight. Here comes Rodriguez. That lefty hook in the lane is good. As the pass picked off by Rodriguez. But then picked off the other way as Terry, on a high dribble, takes it into the lane, splits the double team, lays it up and in. Stopped at the free throw line. They'll send it back to Fields, who will shoot with six on the clock, and it's good. And it is a long two-pointer. Not been able to convert since then. Ball pops loose, and it's still loose, but then Rodriguez able to track it down. He'll take it in transition. Yes, and one. No stop ball as Rodriguez able to make it all the way in. Liggins sends it over to Connor Birchfield. And they'll send it over to the corner. Purvis, the only starter on the court. His shot is good. That one just kind of rattled in and out of the cylinder. Small adjustment on that one. Here comes a drive. It's Kyle Washington, lefty hook in the lane. Spent most of the season on the shelf because of a knee injury, but has worked his way back. And now driving all the way in and scoring, Brandon Fields with the blow bomb. 27-22. Washington puts it on the floor, swishes it. Uh, approaches the free throw line, shot it in rhythm. 29-22. Sky Force again by seven. They did lead by eight briefly. Into the lane, McLaughlin puts on the brakes, and he'll swish it from the free throw line. Liggins looking for the opportunity. He'll drive the lane, get all the way to the rack. That one no good, but Marcus Lee says, I'll handle this. And they will say no shot attempt. So that was the first foul to give. Here comes the lob to Lee. He'll put it off the glass and in. Catch and kind of fling it off the glass in one motion. They'll work it back over to Fields off the hard rebound. Fields. Now we'll lob it up to Roberson. He'll put it off the glass and in. Birchfield. Left side. Gets it over to Liggins. Liggins steps back on the 20-footer. It's good. There is a jumper. Free throw line no good. There's Lee again. Tapping it up and in. That's twice. Skyforce by four. They have held the lead. 
since acquiring it midway through the first quarter. And there's a three for Connor Birchfield. Catch and shoot from the left corner. Jarvis Threat returns for Sioux Falls. Pocket pass for Fields. He backs away. Swish. Boy, nice crafty move by Brandon Fields. Back out to Threat with 10 to shoot. Threat probing, getting into the lane. He's alone. He puts it up, and it's good. Jarvis Threat had to. That's all he had to do. Nice feed from LeCompte. But then underneath, it's Taylor who hit the underside of the rim. He was kind of in no man's land is on his own. And then Liggins turns it into two points. 34-35. On the other end, LeCompte with a free throw line jumper. That one finds the nylon. Terry just coming back from a stint with the Phoenix Suns. LeCompte, he will launch for three, and it's good. Roberson. And LeCompte. Sends it over to Fields. He's open. His three is good. Brandon Fields with nine. Liggins over to Cook. Cook had to watch his feet to see where he was. Now he'll drive left baseline. Now it finds three as he streaks to the basket. And I can understand, but still six players only have been in the game yet. Three sends over to Putney for three and swishes from the right corner. And that pass stolen by Putney. They tried to work it in the post. Here comes Purvis. Purvis, nice screen as Charles Cook the third. Three on the other end, not willing to jump early. And they'll send it over to Putney. Is he still hot? Putney is still stroking. Usually pretty good at getting to the line, but the Clippers, they have to be careful. They don't have a lot at, at their disposal. There is a drive and score for Evan Taylor. Fields pocket pass to Roberson, who is denied by Putney. But then the pass tipped away from three, and they get it back to Roberson, who then completes the deal. 54-47, D. Rodriguez in the corner. Free throw line, here comes a floater for Rodney Purvis. They get 58-49. Fields on the right wing, into the lane. Has the ball popped out of Roberson's hand, stolen away by Purvis. And they'll send it to Cook. Cook will drive, and he will send it through the rim. It's LeCompte. Gives it up to Fields. Back to Roberson, who will attack the rim. Jam that one down the pipe. Rodriguez, excuse me, that's Roberson doing some work. Cannot tap it back in. The Sky Force get the rebound. Terry's going to take it. Gets all the way through. Jams it down. As Fields was the one. 65-54, back to an 11-point game. There's a three for Taylor, no good. And the Sky Force let the rebound escape, and Rodriguez able to put it back up and in. Purvis off the screen, back to Threet. Threet will get into the lane, gets to the rack. No, but then there's Terry. Manuel Terry. So he has certainly, definitely gained his due with those three block shots tonight. Emmanuel Terry off the feed from Rafael Putney. One-handed pass over to Loving. Loving. Then fires a pass down low. Rodriguez puts it up and in. Receiving and then scoring. Three. He will take it in on his own. He'll puts it off the glass and scores. He's got eight. Purvis off the pick and roll. Free throw line jumper. Too strong. Rebound. Pops right to Terry. He'll put it up. No good. Terry again. That one finally drops through. Rodriguez a couple of dribbles. They'll send it out. 10 to shoot as LeCompte, free throw line, works his way around Cook and scores. And he'll get one more. LeCompte, nice footwork as he put on the brakes and then just kind of worked his way around Cook. Same one you're watching on Facebook Live tonight. They'll send it out to Putney for three in the corner. It's good. Rafael Putney. Dead. They'll work it back around to Rodriguez, left wing. And that one poked out by Cook. And it's a four-on-one the other way. It is Putney. Slams it home off the feed from Charles Cook the third. The Clippers trailing. There's Love, and that's LeCompte hanging in the air, and that one curls in. And a pair at the line for Cook to make it 80-67. to 67. Fields for three, and it's good. As Brandon Fields drains it from the left wing. But Putney with... Now 85 blocks so far this season. And here comes Roberson off the feed. Terry looking for a call as that one tried to be poked free. Here comes Jarvis Street. 
as he gets the nice feed from Rodney Purvis. 11 point Skyforce lead, ball tipped in the air and Terry will snare it. Liggins on the run, gets right side of the lane, finds the trailer, it's Raphael Putney. 86-73 as the Skyforce lead it by 13 on information 1000 K. Sends it up top, Fields, back to LeCompte. And then he'll drive the lane, hook it up over Terry and scores. They'll work with Purvis, run it with Lee. They'll put it up, and there's Purvis. And that was the option that presented itself. He scores it, 88-75. Nice work down low as they get it to Roberson. A little pocket pass to make it 88-77. Threet, good. Pulls up in the free throw line jumper. Rebound, Marcus, able to pull it down for the Sky Force. No numbers, but they'll get it to the corner where Purvis is open, and he scores it. Street puts on the brakes, finds room, grazes the iron with the first shot, gets his own rebound. Marcus Lee had trouble gathering, but did finally clutch it and finish it. And the Skyforce rebounded with Liggins. Oh, sent the pass through the lane. Kind of alligator arm that one in fields. We'll take it the other direction and score it. 95-83. Again, Loving with the four fouls cannot afford really to expend many more because the Clippers are shorthanded. Baseline jumper off the inbound. Down the court. Taylor puts it on the deck. Takes it in the lane. Gets to the rack. He'll score and get one more. The Sky Force scored 86. Liggins with six to shoot. He will pull up at 20. Fire it and rattles home. DeAndre Liggins with eight points, four rebounds, and three assists. 9.7 left in the period as LeCompte sends to the corner. It's a three for Taylor. Yes! Swishes with 1.1 left in the period. And the Clippers lobbing it up for Roberson. And he's able to send it through. Connor Birchfield is back on for the Sky Force. Gives it into Washington, who's clearing some space. And that one hits the front rim and then drops in. Game between these two teams this season. Each has won on the opposing team's floor. LeCompte from 27 feet, and he buries it from the left wing. Mono LeCompte. Pass to Putney. He'll get through the lane, and Roberson will back away. Rebound Marcus. Over to Liggins. Liggins, what's... His mode, he gets all the way to the rack and he'll score. Count that basket, he'll get one more. And Greg Steensma of the Sky Force. And it came to Luby and he had one more than Steensma. Shot no good for the Clippers out of the timeout. Charles Cook III is able. He will take one off the dribble and no good on the three, but it's stolen back by Charles Cook III. He'll take it all the way in and score. Fields, left side, sends it out to Loving, loving for three. He will take the time, he will set up, and he will connect. 13-point Skyforce lead. They have the ball with Liggins, free throw line jumper. He'll pull up and hit. And Liggins in double figures with 13. LeCompte looking things over as he is being faced up by Putney. They'll send it away. Here's Rodriguez a three, and it's good. Skyforce conversely, seven of 19. Into the lane, oh, here it comes. RP to RP, and it's the tall one. 18 to 104. Now here's Taylor, he gets bumped, and he lays it in, we'll get one more at the line. Again, shorthanded as they are. Still really putting it all on the line tonight. There's Rodney Purvis. Pull up jumper is good. The Sky Force still lead it, and they have held the lead ever since the early stages of this one. Step back jumper for LeCompte and it's good. Purvis surveying, he'll cross over, send it back out to Charles Cook the third. He will take it all the way in and score. Two at the line for the Clippers and the Sky Force have it, Trey leading by 12. Liggins steps back for a long two and it's good. DeAndre Liggins with the touch. Rodriguez, Rodriguez will drive and that one off the backboard. No, they actually did say it hit the rim. And then here's a floater in the lane for Fields. Yes, and one. Skyforce by 11, under two minutes left. 
Cook. He will rise for a catch and shoot three, and down it goes for CC3. Skyforce with the advantage. Liggins, 10 to shoot, gives it up to Terry. Terry will jam it down. 131 to 115. On the other end, lightning flash to the basket for Lacombe. Nevada Smith will become the second all-time on the win list with Purvis connecting from the free throw line to make it 133 to 115, to 117, excuse me. 45 seconds to go as Fields gives it up. Rodriguez pushes it up, got the foul and the bucket is over. The final score, the Sioux Falls Sky Force 135 and the Agua Caliente Clippers 120.